good life riders welcome back for another five minute friday today we are out doing a little ride and i thought i would talk to you about what makes an experienced rider and i want to hear you guys' input because i think experienced rider can mean something different in every aspect of it you might be a type of rider who rides your bike every single day to work and back but maybe you have never been on a long distance ride ever and would not be experienced at all in that type of riding never ridden more maybe you've ridden for 20 years and have never ridden more than an hour and a half maybe you have ridden for 20 years long distance and have thousands of miles under your belt but you can't do a u-turn in the middle of the road all of those things are different experience and make you a different experienced rider so everybody goes around puffing their chest saying I'm an experienced rider I've ridden 150,000 miles but yet they can't do a u-turn in the middle of the road or maybe you have ridden hundreds and thousands of miles but you have never ridden the Dalton Highway and that changes how experienced you are I have really noticed in this past year of riding how each of the different things that I've done from the slow speed skills to doing the tail of the dragon at the beginning of the year to doing Iron Mountain Road here just recently to doing long sweeping curves going down hills and mountains how each one of those gives you a different experience and handles different set of skills that you need to be able to have to uh, handle those types of situations so I think one thing is we as riders need to be better as a whole at taking others along with us and helping everyone raise the bar and not letting ourselves as individuals um, become complacent as riders do things that will challenge your skills and do a lot of research to find out um, what kinds of things you can do to improve your skills I have found that doing the slow speed skill stuff is a different type of joy when you get down a, um, a particular move or able to lean your bike and and do something you weren't able to before is different than when you do something like accomplish riding the tail of the dragon or riding some big curvy road or riding in the mountains each one of those things gives you a different thrill and each one of those are things that you have to experience in order to be able to um, improve yourself and also to be able to say you know you can watch hours and hours of writing and skills writing stuff you know technical and until you uh, do it you actually aren't able to uh, really truly grasp it and be able to accomplish it so that's the little talk about my thoughts on experience they all differ you know I'm not experienced at all on riding a track doing racing stuff 
getting out and scraping my knee, turning corners. But yet the people that are able to do that may not be able to ride multiple days or do an iron butt challenge or something like that. And every single one of those is different for each of us. So that's my thoughts on experiencing. Let me know in the comments below your thoughts on what makes you an experienced rider. And until next time, keep the sunny side up, keep the rubber side down, and have an utterly awesome day.